What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be diving into Zechariah chapter 14. The title of this message is The Prophecy of the Coming Day of the Lord and the Messiah's Kingdom, our Lord Jesus Christ. So I want to give you this chapter is actually broken down into six events, and I'm going to give you that breakdown at the end of this video. So I want to tell you a little bit about what this chapter is about and what to expect out of this chapter, and then I'll give you that breakdown. So without further ado, let's start right now. It is this physical invisible kingdom on earth that will that will all inspiring subject of Zechariah's great prophecy in this chapter. The prophet begins with nations attacking Jerusalem during the Great Tribulation. He then describes these nations' final destruction at Christ's second, second um, coming. This begins the day of the Lord, when Christ is fully manifest, plainly revealed to everyone in all his glory and majesty. His power will be manifest physically and supernaturally, and it will be visible to all to see. His appearance will be ac accompanied by incredible and natural incredible natural and supernatural events even changing the topography of Israel he will fight against the vanquished the enemies of God and his people he will cleanse the land of sin and idolatry and he will establish righteousness and justice throughout the whole world many scholars and students of God's word believe this point these points to a a return of Christ that is his return before thousand, a thousand year reign. When Christ returns, life will be restored to its original purpose, the purpose to, for which everything was created. Life will be holy, set apart to the Lord and bring glory to him. People and nations will rightfully worship the true creator and those who do not will be punished. This is the wonderful passage of the but this is the wonderful message of this passage before us, the prophecy of the coming day of the Lord the, and the Messiah's kingdom, our Lord Jesus Christ. So now let's go into the breakdown so you'll be able to add this to your notes, add this to your database. The first event that you'll see is covered in verses 1 to 2, 1 to 2. And what you'll see is the attack of Jerusalem. So the second event. The second event is the Messiah's intervention, invisible appearance. You'll see this in verses three to seven. Event number three, the establishment of the Messiah's kingdom on earth. You're going to see this in verses eight to 11. The fourth event is the destruction of Israel's enemies. This is covered in verses 12 to 15. And the final, the, the fifth event, sorry, the fifth event is the universal worship of the Messiah, the King, covered in verses 16 to 19. And the final event is all life will be holy, set apart to the Lord, covered in verses 20 to 21. If this was helpful to you, like this video. If you have any questions, put them in the comments below. If you type amen in the comments um, I will send you a personal message. Also, if you want a full breakdown of this um, chapter, I do a Bible study at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every day, and we'll be covering this shortly. So um, you can always type in my name in YouTube, go to the live section, and look at the live of Zechariah chapter 14. I want to thank you for watching. God bless you. God bless your family, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.